The next topic we'll be covering are the capacity of Cosmos DB containers. So what is capacity? Capacity defines the amount of underlying resources are available to support consumption of resources, such as compute and storage. As we've briefly touched upon before, Cosmos DB has two capacity modes, provision throughput and serverless. Provision throughput. In this mode, you allocate a specific amount of throughput for your containers. This throughput is quantified in terms of request units per second. This mode is suitable for workloads where traffic can be predicted. It offers a high degree of flexibility, letting you match your provision capacity to the expected demand. Serverless. This mode is the opposite in its approach. Instead of provisioning in advance, you simply run database operations without setting any predetermined capacity. This mode is beneficial for smaller workloads or those that might experience unpredictable traffic spikes. While it offers the advantage of simplicity and configuration, there are some inherent limitations to be aware of. When it comes to geo distribution, the provision throughput option in Cosmos DB offers unlimited multi region support. In contrast, the serverless option is restricted to a single region. In terms of storage capacity, while provision throughput allows for unlimited storage per container, serverless is capped at 50 gigabytes. Performance wise, both options deliver less than 10 ms latency for point reads. However, while provision throughput guarantees less than 10 ms latency for writes under its SLA, serverless offers less than 30 ms for writes, as covered by its SLO. Regarding billing, provision throughput charges per hour based on the set RUS, irrespective of actual RU consumption. On the other hand, serverless charges are based on the actual RUS consumed by your operations, billed on an hourly basis. 